my alarm went off and I literally woke up out of like being dead asleep in a dream. <laughs> she told the mother boy step aside when she let me off to the dance floor. I followed the left to right. Yeah, I followed the left to right. I told these other girls step aside. From the moment she caught my I was going to say that I upped my breakfast game, but I I didn't. I just ate one thing more than I usually do, which I had two Eggo waffles and then I had Pop-Tart. And the reason why I had a Pop-Tart is because typically if I just have two waffles, I'll get into class and then literally an hour into class when I have two hours left, I'm hungry. And I'm like, typically I have 30 minutes until our break thing because we typically break about halfway through the class. Um, and then I'm like, well, so maybe that'll eliminate this, but hopefully it also won't make me anxious. So we're gonna see how this goes. I just met my neighbor. She's very nice and she's a rape claw. <laughs> okay, I passed the Starbucks. I always pass the Starbucks on my way to and from school. And I thought today was the day to try a pumpkin spice frappuccino for the first time in my life. I got it without coffee, cause I don't like coffee, so Thought I would try it on camera. Here you go. It's pretty good. I definitely got a bit of spice that I wasn't expecting. So I haven't gotten to my schoolwork yet. And the only reason why is because I was checking through social media, which is something I'm, I'm trying to do like after school. Um, and um, yeah, I sc I'm scrolling through Facebook and there's a casting call for here in Vancouver that auditions are being held this Friday and I don't have an afternoon class so I could make it to the auditions. There's a character who's 19 years old who was female and Caucasian. So I texted my mom and I was like, mom, do you think I should go for it? Cause it wouldn't start filming until February. So I'd still be in school. So I would, you know, if they even bring me in for an audition or, or anything like that, I, I you know, or were to even offer me the role, I would have to let them know, you know, I am in school. So I, you know, my, my schedule would be very, very hectic, but weekends would typically be open. So, but you know, I thought might as well go try and then just let them know ahead of time about it. And, and you know, instead of being like, oh yeah, I'd love to, except for now, like all that stuff. So I don't know if I'd put that in my email to them or when I go in physically for the audition, just let them know. But yeah, so I don't know. I'm waiting for my mom's response because I value her opinion. Very much so. So I ended up going for it. Um, <laughs> I um, basically, I sent the email. Um, this basically means I need to find somewhere in town tomorrow to uh, print a headshot because we've already sent them via email, but you never want to show up to an audition and not have any headshots or resumes because they might want them. And then you're like, oh, I don't have any. So I don't want that to happen. So. I'm gonna look up tonight um, places to go and print him. I have come to the conclusion that there is definitely a child who lives above me or the family has a child because I can currently hear them having a temper tantrum. You probably can't hear, but it's happening. Well, I have finished the pitches for next week, so that's a fun time. Uh, the movies I did that I hate um, are, I did the Emoji movie, even though I've never seen it, uh, so I probably shouldn't have done that, but uh, I just did an elevator pitch for that one, which is essentially just, you know, who the main protagonist is, what type of film it is, and then basically the log line, and then what makes that film unique, so I can get that from Wikipedia. Um, and I know that I would not like that film, so I don't really have to watch it to know that I would hate it. Um, and uh, you shouldn't judge a book by its cover, but whatever, I'm gonna use it. Um, and then the other one I did was Batman versus Superman, Dawn of Justice, I think that's what it's called, because I do not like that movie. And then for the three minute pitch, I did Once Upon a Time in Hollywood, because I did not enjoy that film. Um, now I am going to have some dinner. I don't know what I'm gonna have yet, but I'm gonna figure it out. I have started watching the Shadowhunters series because I wanted to start a new series on Netflix instead of, you know, maybe finishing uh, Chilling Adventures of Sabrina like I should. Um, but I've started watching Shadowhunters, so I've watched the first two episodes. It's um, it's pretty good. Like, you know, nothing like crazy crazy. Uh, the writing is a little cringy sometimes, but you know. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna head to bed. So thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. All my social media is in the description. Love you all.